For as long as I can remember, people have told me to train to become bigger and stronger. Rugby's been a big part of my life and weight training goes hand in hand with that. Throughout my career, I've achieved a lot of success. I've been fortunate enough to play for the Queens and Reds and had the opportunity to play in Japan. Being an athlete has taught me a lot of things, but one thing I've discovered on my own is the importance of looking after myself and my body. As I start to focus on more things outside of rugby, I'm beginning to find a passion for other exercises. Pilates is something I've always wanted to try, but I've been afraid to. You see all the classes dominated by girls on Instagram and just think the exercises like that aren't for men my size. My goal is to work on my mobility and become more flexible. So I've decided to finally give it a go. I'm going to be pretty hard to miss in the class, so hopefully that can encourage more men to look beyond the weights room and embrace new forms of exercise. Pilates is a big part of my weekly routine. I've been going to a studio for a few years now and it's easy to find motivation because it makes my body feel good. I've also started incorporating some weights into my training and I've grown to love it. A studio or gym environment is where I feel most comfortable. I have a complicated relationship with cardio and by complicated, I mean non-existent, running in particular. I've never liked running or been a runner. I'm usually running the other way to get away from it. But my friends are doing a fun run and it's something I really want to do with them. I'm determined to become a better runner and complete the fun run. I'm about to do my first Pilates session. A little worried, but I'm keen to give it a go. All right, Cohen, so Pilates is a type of exercise that's going to focus on improving your mobility, your muscle strength, and then your control within specific movement patterns. And it's gonna teach you how different parts of your body work in isolation, which combined is really important for preventing and managing any sort of injury. So when you first start, I would recommend working within a range that's suitable for you because obviously that's gonna improve over time. Um, if you are using it to rehab injury, then make sure you pay attention to those pain levels and don't push it too far beyond what's uncomfortable. And yeah, just enjoy. Visit the Exercise Right Performance Hub for more training tips from qualified exercise professionals.